Yeah, we're gonna flip it over. We're gonna flip the prop car. Man, you can flip this shit by yourself. You know how hard it is to flip this by myself? Uh oh, everybody's dirty. You guys are dirty. There, much better now. It just so happened that it, lined up the that, it, that it worked out that not these wheels down here, yeah. but those these, lined up. yeah, that both those wheels line up in the tracks sometimes. Cool. So anyway, there you go, guys. Looks like the car is coming out of the ground. One step closer to moving it to the backyard. Yeah, and if you haven't seen it for a while. This is what the bottom looks like. Those are the caster wheels that I put on semi recently. And then the fog for the exhaust is all run through here. And I went and stabilized the wheels. Remember yesterday I, I told you guys that the wheels are stable, the suspension doesn't drop. And that's why right here, I mean, I've got bar support there and here and there. And the wheels don't touch the ground. They like come like that close to hitting the ground because they're 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 dummy wheels. This thing could have a flat tire, and I don't care. I know what this is. This is the battery in the charger for this camera. And I know I've vlogged this camera before, and I've said before the screen is cracked, but it still works because I had a little bit of uh, battery life left in it. I just didn't have anything to charge it by. So hopefully, that's what this is right here. Dun, dun, dun. So, digital battery charger. And I know this is like so interesting right now. Oh my gosh, you got a charger for his camera and a battery. Ooh, give me something Halloween related. Do you know what kind of good pictures this camera can take? All right, so really, really happy right now. So yeah, charger and battery. And this, this camera is 1920 by 1020 HD. So hopefully this year for the haunt, this is one that I'm going to use at the prop car to get like really good footage. At least that's the plans right now. I don't know. Maybe I'll take it and actually make this the, the roaming camera and use the HD flip for the prop car. That thought just occurred to me, but I got to see what this thing can do first. And on to the mystery package. From... Your online bookstore. Now, I don't remember getting anything, but I think that I might know ah, who it's from. Oh, no freaking way. Oh, my gosh, guys. Holy crap. This is so cool. 
I believe that I have uh, ABC Noise to thank for this. It's a Woggle of Witches! How cool is that? Oh, so awesome. This is like... This is like total childhood memory right here. Alright, thank you very much. I so appreciate that. That is so freaking cool. This made my day. Today at work, kind of crappy. This made my day. So thank you. Um, wow. Alright guys, so I'm <laughs> using the new camera and you can see, like I said before, the screen is extremely uh, squished or whatever. Smashed. But it still works. And take a look at this. It's a little bit brighter with this one. If I get too close, it'll be all blurry, but that's okay. So anyway, yeah. Oh look, I'm vlogging myself vlogging myself. <laughs> Two cameras on me at the same time. I wonder if I could split screen this. No, I'm not gonna sit there and edit that. The reason, the main reason why I got that storage rack in my bedroom the other day is so that I could take all these cans of paint that I got for free, all of them right there, and like put them somewhere other than out here because the next step right now is to get all this stuff cleared out from back behind the prop car so that I can move this out, so I can move these rails and get the rails into the backyard as a starting point because I can fit these through the gate over here. Oh, I got to get the rest of this trash out of here too. And I know, I'm burning daylight. But this post right here, and again, I'm not sure if you guys can see it. I have to take this post out, and then this section right here of the fence, and then the gate will swing open. And I also have to cut these bushes too. So much prep work just to get this dang thing in the backyard. But at least once this is out of here, this is like the major thing. This is the major thing. I get this out of here, and all the haunt stuff should hopefully start to uh, fall into line. So maybe. Oh, and Scott, JHMDF, was also a co-host last night. I spaced it off. So, Scott, I'm sorry, dude. Yeah, if you guys caught Vlog TV last night, he was the one without the shirt on. Oh, hey, um, have I shown you guys this yet? <laughs> It's hard to believe that three days have passed already. Well, seven, three days from the time you guys see that. Time has passed already. It's going to go quick. It's already going quick. I mean, what, July's almost over? Wow, okay. So right now, it's not gonna be too interesting, and it's dark outside. Um, all that scrap metal from the prop car, I'm about ready to uh, bring inside, because I don't wanna scrap it. I don't wanna get rid of it, because I can use it for more props next year, or if I like pull off something here at the end. I'm gonna throw it in the corner of the bedroom. In the corner of the storage room. And, you guys remember this? I still have this to do. I gotta do something with that. Still the old box, and the old chair, and that old box. Okay, so you guys remember the, the paints that I got a while back that the dude dropped off from the yard sale? They, he gave them to me for free. Um, I never saw him when he dropped them off, but he just kind of dropped them off. And I know that I went through them once before, but um, there, there's a bunch of just regular, you know, spray paints here, these different colors. Uh, some of these are really cool. I mean, that'd be like a 70s, or to me, it'd be a 70s color. Um, there's Scotch Guard in here. There's um, granite type stuff. There's marble effects and there's like a whole plethora there's a uh, pearl uh, there's all-purpose spray adhesive there's the glow in the dark which uh, to my I this stuff I don't know have you have, have you guys ever seen this glow in the start have you guys ever seen this glow in the dark spray paint work I, I haven't but hey there there's your Halloween uh, reference for the day and also, high beams. This is like a bright orange. I wonder if it still works. I don't know. But, okay. These are the funny ones. Oh, let me get to these first. Um, some tempera. And also some clear finish. Not a big deal, I got plenty of that. Here's the funny stuff though. Look, it's shortcuts. 
one day I'm going to grow up and be a big can just like them. Okay, I'm trying to put some humor in this, you know, like work with me people. But this one's funny. Look, it's stiffy. <laughs> Look, I've got a stiffy, a uh, fabric stiffener, which I don't know if maybe this would be better to try and do uh, versus dry lock. I've never had any experience about it. And I've heard of stiffies, just like, you know, JHMDF has obviously heard of hand jobs, like I'm sure everybody else has. Um, but, I'm not going to sit here and read this in front of you guys, but I, I'm just wondering if that would be like a viable option to doing like some silk flowers, to put that on them before you dry lock them, if you're going to do like the stone effect. So I don't know, maybe I'll try that. Anyway, I just thought that you guys might want to see what came in Z-Box. Z-Box of paints. So for the first time since I've started vlogging, not counting the time at West Coast that the uh, super upgraded internet was like super uber slow, um, tonight's vlog, I mean obviously if you guys are seeing this, then everything worked out okay, but um... These lights that are blinking here, those aren't good. That means that I'm not online. That's the router, and uh, that's the modem. It's got a Comcast uh, high speed. So as of right now, I don't know what's going on. I'm still gonna edit and get this online. Well, no, I'm still gonna edit, and um, hopefully it'll be back up, or else my ass be going to, well, McDonald's, there is no McDonald's, it's 24 hours. I, I don't know, does Denny's have wireless? <laughs> I don't have a laptop, okay? So bringing this whole computer and, you know, the keyboard and the mouse to Denny's might look like really weird. Subscriber shout out of the night goes to Tio Mella. I th hope that's right. Thank you for subscribing. It was actually a day ago that you did that and I just kind of spaced it off last night. I've had the door open. I've got bugs outside that came in. Um, anyway, guys, happy haunting. We'll see you tomorrow. Um, I was able to get everything removed from around the prop car, so tomorrow I'm going to sweep up and see what I can do about possibly moving it or at least plan to move it by this weekend. Ooh, that'd be cool. Have an epic party. Uh, oh, wait gathering of people this weekend with a little campfire and everything and have people over to uh, move it. Awesome ideas. Anyway, again, happy haunting. See you guys tomorrow.